Microsoft Word uses units of measurement for a lot of things, including indentations, margins, and the ruler tool. But what if you prefer to work in centimeters instead of inches, or vice versa? Or maybe you want to see measurements in points or pikers. Not a problem. I'm Jack from Proofed. Let's look at how to change units of measurement in Microsoft Word for Mac. In order to change the units of measurement in Microsoft Word for Mac, you simply go to the menu bar, Word, Preferences, under Authoring and Proofing Tools, select General, and then here where it says Show Measurement in Units of, you can select from inches, centimeters, millimeters, points, and pikers. Simply select the option you prefer, and Microsoft Word has made the change for you. Now when you view the ruler, you'll see that the units of measurement are in millimeters, or if I change them again, centimeters. The default will be inches if you're in the USA and centimeters if you're in the UK. However, the two units you might not know, points and pikers, are both used in typography for measuring text and parts of the page. Specifically, a point is roughly equivalent to one sixth of an inch. It's mainly used to measure font sizes and line spacing. For example, this number next to the font type you've selected refers to points. In this instance, I'm using a Calibri body themed font with a 12 point font size. 12 points make up a pica, which is used for measuring larger parts of a document, such as line length, margin sizes, and the width and depth of columns. You may not need these two units very often unless you're a typographer, but if you do need them, you can easily select them using the method I've outlined here. And that is how you change units of measurement in Word for Mac. Don't forget, check out the resources in the description below. And as always, any questions you have, ask them in the comments. Your writing proof.